this is Flippin' Bean coming at you. What we're going to be covering today is something that I'm not normally covered, but you know what? We're going to do it anyways. Um, I'm covering a titanium dog tag by TieSurvival.com. This is a brand new item in which he's starting to carry, starting to make himself. He um, makes these out of titanium, obviously. Now, here's the kicker. He sand casts his own silver rings, so it's not like it's attached by, like, anything retarded so your basic beaded military general issue chain I put that on myself until I get something a little nicer right then you have a electro anodized see that skull pattern that's kind of ghosted in there electro anodized titanium dog tag now here's a kind of a cool thing i was playing around with this at first see this bevel on it he puts a bevel he rounds it and puts a bevel on it well he bevels it almost down to a small edge now in extreme nature if you had to i mean yeah this could i mean i cut a piece of paper with this thing so it's not like it's a hard thing to do it'd be the same thing as putting a straight edge on the of a ruler on the side so it's not like tactically sharp it's just sharp ish if you will um, and then, well, like I said, he sand casts his own silver that he basically smelts down and casts it himself. And then he textures it and adds a nice, let's get that focus. He adds a nice, adds nice texturing to it. So then, obviously, you can't break tie and then reform it under that high heat so what he does he does silver hand cast it and then now you have a ring to hang it off of so like i said tie survival look him up esteban acosta there's his email and his website um like i said he just got this new electro anodizer in so normally he was doing flame anodizations now he's doing electro anodizations as well each have their own little flair and, and aesthetics for everybody you know and everybody's needs so um, plan to see that he also I don't uh, I'm gonna post up I'm gonna find some of the pictures of it but he also like I said he casts his own silver jewelry so he's done like a dog tag where it looks like one of those old green little army men was coming out of so it was actually kind of neat and impressive kind of a 3d silver dog tag but that one had a titanium ring mind you because you're working in precious metals ie silver it's gonna cost a little more um, but if you're trying to work your way up to like a steel flame piece and you know you want to get into something like that or if you just want to have something that's you know interesting and cool and you know you can wear it you got that as well he also did a dog tag from look like a, a bullet was uh protruding out of it in a 3d fashion out of all out of silver so you guys look him up i'm gonna put his email below esteban is a great guy to work with we're talking Two to three days, four days at most from what I've seen most of, on the average of his orders being from start to finish. Like you order it and as soon as it's in, it's out. He has no issues. He creates no issues. Great guy to work with. Um, on his website, uh, you can see all the other uh, stuff he has coming out. Peanut lighters, uh, Exotube, Son of Exotube, um, his, you know, um, his uh, spec ops spools for holding Kevlar wire, so if you're making snares and stuff like that. Um, Coupetons. I mean, Marlin spike, chopsticks, straws. If you can think of it in titanium, this man has an idea for it. Um, so look him up. Like I said, it's uh, Thai Survival. And Esteban is a great guy to work with out of Florida. So you Florida peeps, you know, if you want to support your own, you can. So that's all for me, Flippin' Bean. Uh, you guys have a great day and uh, be safe.